Alright YouTube, what's up? 1992 Petro here with a video of my 350 gallon aquarium. Right in front of us, that's Big Doug. He is an Amazon Black Paku. Right back here, you can kind of see him. That's a 12 inch Black Ghost Knife Fish. See, I'll come around the side for you guys. A big knife fish. Right there is a 10 inch spotted royal placostomus. Usually don't see him that big, it's pretty awesome. Now right here is a 17 inch marbled goby. He's a beautiful, beautiful animal and his name is Hector. Now this right here is Jimmy. Jimmy is a common pleco I've had for probably close to eight years now. He's a gigantic pleco. Now way down here is an albino catfish. He's gigantic. He's got to be close to 17 inches himself. All right, so on this side, there is an enormous piece of driftwood. It is a piece of red cedar. That piece weighs close to 40 pounds when it's dry, and it's close to three feet wide. And on this side, this is a piece that I've had for a long time now, and the catfish is now calling it home which is pretty sweet. Now this tank is drilled. It does not have any canister filters, nothing like that. It has a seven foot sump underneath it. So what's going on is right up here is an overflow box that was installed. As you can see, it's flowing a ton of water. It's going down these hoses into the side of the sump. It goes through two drip trays into a refugium. Now this refugium is growing Anubis. And as you can see, the refugium light of choice is a Kessel 160. And then it just goes into this huge biomedia chamber. There's just a whole bunch of bio balls and other stuff like that. There's also 600 watts of heater. I chose to run an external pump. Not too many people are doing external pumps now and it's very easy to remove. It's all on unions. <laughs> Then it comes back up through PVC pipe right back into the side of the tank. This tank is 8 foot by 3 foot by 2 foot. And who knows, maybe in the near future there will be a stingray in here as well. But we'll see about that. Alright, let me know what you guys think and if you have any more questions, feel free to ask 1992 signing off.